In terms of the numbers, we're looking about one to three inches here in the northern half of the state. Across central Wisconsin on the eastern side, as they're going to see a little bit more snow on Saturday, we are looking about a trace to an inch of development. Uh, we're hoping here across central Wisconsin we get closer to that inch. But as we mentioned, this system is mainly tracking to the northern half of the state. Our future track forecast showing that very light and scattered activity as we head into the overnight hours. We'll combine a little bit overnight, as you can see here, and maybe starting to break its way down towards Wausau or Stevens Point, but most of the activity is getting going to be up here in the north woods Saturday morning waking up. If you live on the eastern and northeastern side of the state, you do have a good chance of snow continuously falling to the morning to midday. But once we hit midday, that should start to clear out just a few flurries by the afternoon. Same for Sunday as we'll have mostly dry conditions for the end of the weekend. Extended future track though does show a chance of snow here to the southeast. That's going to be on Tuesday, mainly in the morning hours. And then uh, while we do clear out here for Wednesday, another chance of snow could potentially move in on Thursday. So multiple chances this week in terms the temperatures shouldn't be melting anytime soon, seeing a lot of 32, 33 degree highs. Tonight we drop down to 27. Southeast winds of 5 miles per hour. Forecast tomorrow 33. South winds around 5. Seven day forecast. Let's put it all together. 80% chance of morning snow on Saturday. 20% chance of light snow or flurries Sunday. 40% chance on Tuesday and another 40% chance next Thursday.